Are you done? Today is a huge day for Marvel Avengers. Uh, I love this game. I honestly do. It has flaws, but that's what makes the game stand out to me. Uh, today is a huge day. Today is March 18th as of time of recording, and today we are going to be uh, getting the Hawkeye DLC. We are going to be getting the next gen patch. We're going to be getting the campaign replayability, the harm room customs, and apparently we are also going to be getting a new enemy type, which is like a which drops loot uh, when you defeat it, but it but it won't fight you; it'll just run away, which is cool. And there's new stuff like um, I think there's a new packs for credits and stuff. It's just amazing stuff. I'm. I'm honestly excited, but with excitement comes a very possibility of um, being scared, and I think the thing I'm mostly scared about today is not just the update or the story, all of that, because to me, Marvel Avengers has always knocked it out of the park when it comes to storytelling, when it comes to gameplay, when it comes to diversity, like... I know Kate Bishop and Hawkeye are very similar because, you know, they both use uh, arrows, they both use that of bows and also like swords and stuff, but then you actually see it. There's, when you see the gameplays of it, Hawkeye is so different to Kate Bishop and I'm really excited about that. And now the biggest thing that's happening is going to be the presentation that's the thing that's going to scare me the most because even though I'm excited about uh, this whole thing I'm still scared about uh, what they will be presenting at today's event at the Square Enix Presents will it be good enough to bring players back because there is going to be a significant amount of people watching the stream and we all know that so will this game live up to the hype of this presentation what will they show uh, this is my expectations of what I feel should be shown and what will definitely bring players back to the game bring new players back new players to the game and so much more so let's just dive straight into it this was a long intro but basically uh, they need to show a roadmap. I honestly just hope they show a roadmap. It doesn't have to be detailed. They don't have to give me the specific dates or anything. Just give me your time frame. Just say, not even give a character name. Just give like the, oh, new character, this slot, big update, uh, cloning labs this time, and then after that, two months later or something, another big update, one month earlier will be another character, you know, stuff like that. It's, it'll be f great if they did a roadmap. It doesn't have to be detailed, just give specific times, like, oh, two or three heroes in the spring or something like that. I'd really appreciate that. But I think that'd be pretty cool. Like, just give clarification. I'm sure at this, uh, at this event they'll remind everyone, oh, yeah, Hawkeye's in the game, all of our free downloads and all of that. So, yeah. Um, also, there is something I think we all want, and that is a reveal of a new character. Now, I think the reason they didn't reveal a new character at the end of the Hawkeye deep dive is because possibly that character is in the Hawkeye story. So they don't want to spoil it that much, but yeah, I don't really know. I really hope that they do bring something... There, maybe Spider-Man, maybe Black Panther, maybe both, that'd be pretty cool. Maybe show cloning labs uh, coming with something. Maybe show another big update like raids or something. Show environments, show more gameplay, anything like that. Fantastic, but I think the main thing we want is a roadmap. And 
maybe they'll show more space stuff. Maybe they'll show big stuff. I feel like this event has something big planned for Marvel Avengers. I honestly think this could impact the future of this game. And just like the Hawkeye name says, it's future imperfect. It's a very interesting game. It's a very interesting time to be a Marvel Avengers fan because, well, the game itself is good in combat, but it lacks stuff at endgame content. And I think that they should capitalize on this huge event of at Square Enix. Capitalize that, yes, they have endgame content to show. So just show us this endgame content show us a roadmap and show us other stuff that you want but the main things are a roadmap and endgame content just show those two stuff and a possible release dates of those and I think people will be happy about this game I for one love this game but this game does have flaws and I'm willing to admit that because if you love a game you have to say yes I like this game for the positives as well as the negatives and this game is good when it comes to character uh, design I really like the design of the characters I love the combat and all of that I love I even like how they wrote the characters the characters story everything from a story standpoint and character standpoint fantastic it's just the end game I don't like because there isn't that much of stuff to do even tachyon missions i rarely do it because i just don't feel like doing them but yeah guys let me know in the comments down below what do you expect from today and i just want to say happy hawkeye day i hope you guys enjoy your day leave a like subscribe all that good stuff and as always this is lightning h8 blaze out